To honor Filipino athletes and the creative industry, the Office of the President, Presidential Communications Office, and RTVM organized the Concerto Sa Palacio, which will happen on Sunday. Various local artists and are from abroad will be performing to showcase their world-class talents. Kenneth Pacente has more. Palacio will be happening again on Sunday at exactly 6.30 in the evening. Various artists who have gone viral on social media or are beginning to make their names in the creative industry will be featured to give them a venue to express their talents. The Voice France Season 8 4 Chair Turner Ivan Mendoza and the a cappella group champion from Baguio City, Pino Pella, will be performing in the event. Also among the performers is the veteran group of dancers, Douglas Nieras Power Dance. Besides providing entertainment, the activity also aims to pay tribute to the Filipino athletes. Therefore, the arrival of 300 Filipino athletes from different fields of sports is expected. In his first State of the Nation address, President Ferdinand R. Marcos Jr. recognized the people in the creative industry. The creativity of the Filipino is truly world class. We excel in arts and culture, new media, live events, avenues which generate primary and downstream jobs for our creative and talented countrymen. Unfortunately, ang mga hanap buhay na ito ang unang pinadapa ng pandemya at ang pinakahuli namang makabalik sa normal. The public can watch the concert through the official Facebook page and YouTube channel of Radio Television Malacanang. The Concerto sa Palacio para sa Atletang Pilipino is a project of the Office of the President, Presidential Communications Office, and RTVM. This is an initiative of the government to support the creative industries that are severely affected by the COVID-19 pandemic. Kenneth Pasyente for the Nation.